Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Um, I would like to talk to you about uh, the differences between a gamekeeper in um, hunting shooting club and uh, and a gamekeeper in a company, whether that's private or state owned, it doesn't matter. So the main difference is that the gamekeeper, like I am, in a hunting club, we do our job as a volunteers. So that means we spend our time, our energy, our money, our resources to keeping the grounds safe and animals fed and we're trying to hunt some some predator, predators where they are uh, with uh, um, hair so like foxes uh, golden jackals or with feathers like crows stuff like that and we use our our resources meaning we use our time our money our energy our vehicles no one no one pays us to do that so this is a volunteer um, we get paid in a different way let me give an example I'm a member of a shooting club and so because it's almost 50 of us in that ground since uh, since not a lot of people can do that job because some some of them are just um, maybe too old they, they cannot walk around as much as I can or I have a vehicle which is like SUV so I can drive in some rough terrain they, they have normal vehicles so they cannot do my job so we get paid with um, we get more things to hunt for example if some people can hunt a roebuck we can hunt two or if they have some restrictions like for example they there they will shoot like two um, uh, prickets or they'll call them as spikers or like young ones we can shoot uh, trophy animals so or, or um, if some more animals are uh, culled we get paid with uh, venison sometimes when I say paid so that is the main difference. On the other hand, uh, people who work in a company, whether, like I said, whether that's state-owned or private-owned, they get, number one, they get resources. So they get car, which they use. They get money to put the gas in the car. Uh, they, once they need to build a high seat, uh, nails and wood materials from which the high seat is made is being bought. We, as a hunting club, sometimes ask for do donations uh, those companies uh, they're always always their job is to make money on the other hand normal shooting club is not there to make money it's there to make its members happy so it's just just different priority uh, and um, very very big difference any gamekeeper who does he, who does his job properly and is paid spends uh, 300 days in the woods in a year sometimes they go two uh, two, two times in a day in the morning and in the evening on the other hand i spend in my hunting ground let's say 50 days a year okay we do have more gamekeepers we do not have one but i spend in 50 days sometimes an hour sometimes five hours people who are paid for that job they spend if necessary hold all day uh, to build high seats to be feeding stations to use um to feed the animals to pull salt blocks to use tractors to to make uh, food plots, to cut the grass, uh, or to make a hay, and then to move hay to feed, let's say, red deer over the course of a winter, because otherwise they would be eating um, uh, bark from trees or eating trees, and then they would make damage to some crops, uh, like peeling a skin off an apple tree. So it it, it is very very big difference be between between like like I said, the voluntary gamekeeper and the paid one because you you feel it once you get in the ground because more time and energy is put in that ground by the gamekeeper once he's paid and he does that job as a professional. So I hope I make it clear how I see it at that things around in Croatia. And uh, till the next time we meet. Cheers. Bye. Good hunting. Enjoy.